about some fundamental processes in biology. This will allow us to understand how drugs are working, how drugs are petitioning around the cell, how uh, cancer is growing and moving. And so the first things you'll probably see coming out of this technology are not necessarily tools where you go to your doctor and you, the doctor who's practicing medicine is using quantum technology sort of on you, but, but rather you're going to find that the drugs seem to get a little bit better. The pipeline to uh, creating a drug and understanding its mechanism of action and getting it through FDA approval may become a little bit faster. And so what you'll see in the beginning is that these tools are used in the laboratory to give us more certainty in what we're developing and more ways to see how a drug is working and how it is not working, what might be the source of a side effect. And so you'll see it roll out in the laboratory first, and you may even be blind to how your drug was discovered or how it was developed or engineered, but things will start to work a little bit.